come with me as we go on a date and see if what dr kingsley said was true because man we gotta find out like he's saying african men that cheat and don't cheat i'm putting that clip you're gonna watch it and you'll see why i decided to go on a date with this random man man it was great you better watch the video till the end because it was amazing i'm shy but yeah let's do this african countries with the highest number of men who cheat on their partners <laughs> kenya men cheaters uh -huh. uganda men cheaters nigeria men cheaters with phd hey! south sudanese men cheating cheaters <laughs> rwanda men okay rwanda men don't cheat uh -huh. We only fornicate once in a while. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Gracie D. I hope you guys are doing amazing. I'm doing great here in Kigali, Rwanda, the land of a thousand hills. If you're watching me and you haven't yet subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing. Also, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and share my videos. So, on this episode, I'm going out on a night date here in Kigali, Rwanda. And I want to show you guys, like, you know, on a place that you can come enjoy yourselves here in uh, Kigali. We are at a place called Nyamirambo. It's a cafe zone. It's a place where they basically, you know, there are no cars that are, not, are allowed to come into this place as you can see around their seats all colored in red they also have tents and they have different restaurants so this place is basically for you and your family to come chill here have amazing food enjoy yourselves it's an alcohol free place so you can only have soft drinks so this is one of the places that if you're not a drunkard you can come for a nightlife here in Kigali enjoy your meal and they're quite affordable so I'm going on this date with friends of mine and I want to take you guys along with me and show you places that you can chill when you visit Kigali at night or you can come have your lunch they're always open from Monday to Sunday uh, I don't know from what time to what time so we're going to this specific restaurant that I always see on people's videos it's called Visit Rwanda so we're going to try their dishes today and see how it's gonna be so come along with me and let's enjoy it together uh so guys we are here at nyamirambo cafe zone where you can basically come and have good food great time and actually it's amazing because you know being a ramadan month there's so many people around here and it's on a friday so come with us and let's go enjoy amazing food from here before me taking you on our little date guys i wanna just you know tell you a bit of nyamirambo it's not only the kafri zone area but it's also a very lively neighborhood as you can see this is, was, was already at night and you see there are beautiful stores around where you can get you know uh, organic food from the stores uh you know free of gmos and maybe if you're looking forward to visit kigali and you're wondering which would be the best neighborhood for you to live in i think nyamirambo you know being a very affordable neighborhood it would be a nice place for you to live in you're close to hotels uh, and you know like restaurants and it's very close to town you can actually walk from nyamirambo to the city center if you like walking because it doesn't take you that long live alone that it's a very safe safe neighborhood and you know before you was used to be known as one of the dangerous neighborhoods that they had in Kigali, Rwanda. But right now it's all changed and it's a very safe neighborhood, a very place, nice place for you to live in. So if you visit Kigali, make sure to check out, you know, Nyamirambo Kafri Zone. And that's the best place for you to try the typical Rwandan local dishes. And you'll thank me later. So make sure to watch this video till the end. Tell me what you think about the video. Subscribe if you haven't yet subscribe to this channel we are road to 5,000 subscribers and i can't wait to hit that mark so i'm um, depending on you who is watching and you haven't yet subscribed please do that thing
so we went to this one restaurant called visit rwanda and it was amazing as you can see the place is full there are so many people i think most people love this place and i think they you know it looks nice from outside also from the inside i've had their meals before and it's a great place for you to visit if you're looking forward to go and have a nice meal for dinner lunch or maybe some breakfast so later our food was brought and we all had the same thing like i love this dish every time that i visit this restaurant that is the one thing that i always have and that's us digging in our food oh man it was delicious you know after having a long day this was the perfect way of ending this long day that we had you know shooting content and it was nothing but amazing we had a great time talked you know spending time quality time together as friends and it was great guys after finishing our meal and having a good time we decided to walk you know in other areas of this cafe zone and this is how it all looks like So, my random women watching this video, please tell me is what Dr. Kingsley said true that random men don't cheat? I want to find that out from people who have, you know, been with these men for long, who know them better than me and Dr. Kingsley do, because i know everyone wants to find out so please tell us down on the comment section and i'll really appreciate <laughs> Mm. Thank you, I have eaten.
was finished. Yeah. Bless you. Actually, this is one of the Kigali's nightlife. So I hope guys you're enjoying this video. Keep watching. Keep enjoying this episode. Start guys, start. Yeah, so guys, this is gonna be the end of this episode. We really enjoyed this place. The food was amazing, the portions were great, the prices are quite affordable. Thank you so much, Joel, for bringing me on a day here in Kigali, Randa, in this city. Yeah, so make sure to check out the Nyamirambo Calfri and you know, have an amazing time here. Have good food for those who like drinking. Remember, they don't sell alcohol here. Just soft drinks and see you on the next episode. Bye! Bye-bye! Joel, what's on the pig?